Hello, it's Becca and welcome to The Carriage House, a place to find cozy inspiration for your hearth and home. Today I'm in my kitchen on this rainy autumn afternoon at our little farmhouse on the northern plains of Iowa. I'm lighting candles just to create a warm and nice ambiance inside our home and was just about to put a few groceries away, refill a few spice jars, and then begin making dinner. And tonight I'll be making creamy chicken tikka masala. So as always, I'm really glad you're here with me today and have stopped by for a visit here at the carriage house. So now that the groceries have been put away, the beautiful aroma of spices have been transformed into the garam masala, and I'm now going to make the marinade for the chicken, and I'll be using fresh garlic, ginger, yogurt, and lots and lots of spices. So I'm gonna chop my onion and garlic first and add those beautiful spices to the marinade.
So while our chicken is marinating in the refrigerator, I decided to go ahead and open this international snack subscription box from Tri Treats and I absolutely love these. We use them for our homeschool to supplement our international studies. So this one is centered around Poland so it comes with a variety of snacks from Poland. It also comes with a postcard and a letter that talks about each snack and a little history about it and every month you'll receive snacks from a different country. So that's good and now I'm going to use Redmond's adorable personal blender to make my son a mango lassie. We still have a little ways till dinner so that way he can enjoy his drink while he's playing and I can get back to cooking. So now I'm ready to make the sauce for the chicken tikka masala. I absolutely love Indian food. There's such a complexity of flavors. There's tangy and then there's sweet and then there's spicy and these earthy flavors all combined into one single bite. And I will leave this recipe down below. So now I'm going to add onion, garlic, spices and cream and bring it all together to make a comforting meal on this rainy autumn night. 